Now I'm going to show you the multiplying rabbit trick. It's a lot of fun to do, but you'll need a friend to perform it for. So, oh, there you are, Kiva. Hey, Ryan. <laughs> now, it's important to note, Kiva does not come with a magic set, so you'll need to get one of your own friends to help you out with this trick. Now, Kiva, I've got a mommy and a daddy rabbit here, all right? Mm -hmm. Tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to hold on to one of them, and I need you to hold on to the other one. So okay. place it in your hand, close your hand around it, make a fist. Now watch, if I snap my fingers, the mommy rabbit jumps over to the daddy rabbit, and now you've got both of them. Wow. Pretty neat trick, huh? <laughs> yeah. All right, let's do it again. This time I'm going to have you hold on to both rabbits, the mommy and the daddy. Okay. Hold out your hand. I'm going to ask you to hold on to both, put them in your hand, squeeze your hand tightly. Now watch close. I'll wave my hand, snap my fingers, and now you had mommy and daddy, but now you've got a whole family. Look. Oh my gosh. There's mommy, daddy, and a whole bunch of little baby rabbits. <laughs> Pretty neat trick, huh? Amazing. Thanks for your help. No problem. The multiplying rabbit trick is easy to perform, but it will take a little bit of practice to pull off the necessary sleight of hand. Now, to begin, take the big rabbits and put those on the table. The small rabbits, you're going to hide those in one of your pockets. For me, they're hidden all down here in my left hand jacket pocket. Now, there's one move you're going to need to practice for this trick, and that's where you pretend to place a rabbit into your hand. Here's what it looks like to the audience. You take the rabbit and place it in your hand. Actually, the rabbit's now clipped under my thumb. Here's how to perform it so you understand. Place the rabbit in your hand. As you begin to close your hand around the rabbit, your fingers pull the rabbit back into your hand and your thumb grabs it. Now, it's the timing that makes it look like you're grabbing the rabbit. Just like that. All right? Now, to perform, you're going to tell your assistant that you're going to hold on to one rabbit and she's going to hold on to the other. So you say that and you pretend to take the rabbit and hold it in your hand. Actually, it's now hidden in your hand. You then reach over and grab the second rabbit and squeeze the two together. She thinks it's just that one, but you place both rabbits into her hand. She holds on to the two. You have nothing here, but they think that there's one here and there's one here. You then snap your fingers, open your hand, and show them that the rabbits jump from one hand to the other. Now, in that moment of astonishment, You'll step back and put your hands in your pockets. As you do that, you'll secretly get all the little baby bunnies and hide them in your fingers. Now, what I do is I clip them right in my fingertips so you can very casually bring your hands out, and it looks like everything's fine. You'll then reach over and grab both of the big rabbits, put them together in your hand, and scrunch them together with all the baby rabbits. You then place the whole bunch in the hand of your assistant. They hold on to all the rabbits. You then wave your hand over the two, Stab your fingers and tell them that now there's a whole family. And now you've got the two big bunnies as well as the four baby bunnies. And that's the multiplying rabbits trick.